Hey, hey guys, and welcome to Daily Commitment, where we do a little bit of exercise every day, and we increase that exercise very slowly. Today's an interesting day. Didn't feel like starting my exercises. That's going to happen a lot. A lot of times, just kind of force yourself to get it going. Once you start going, you'll feel better. The next thing you know, it'll improve your whole day. So anyway, let's jump up here. Let's see how close we can get to one full pull-up. We were pretty close last time. We did our engage thing first, like we've been doing, so we didn't cheat with a jump at the beginning, and we got real close to a full pull-up. Let's see. Let's see how we do today, guys. All right, here we go, guys. We're going up. We're going up. We're going up. We're going up. Get a good grab of the branch. All right. We're going to engage. Didn't quite make it, but I was close, and once I got up there, I kind of stayed a little bit and hung, just kind of pulled, just trying to get that last little bit. Let's go inside, let's do some good uh, horizontal pull-ups, and we'll keep getting closer, guys. All right, guys, we're back. We're here in the kitchen. We got an angle that includes the bar, the floor. You can get to see our board on top of tiles on these stools, how we got this higher amount. <clears throat> I'd still like to get some more boards and make this a little higher, but we'll get to that, we'll get to that. It's about getting going as the day goes. Uh, guys. Again here, uh, there's a couple things we wanted to work on. We wanted to work on pulling towards our chest instead of pulling towards our neck. We wanted to work on keeping our body straight and tight during the, uh, during the pull-up rather than letting it go a little loose just to cheat a little bit and to get our pull-up all the way. Another thing we want to work on is the engagement, and that's tightening these shoulders. See, I'm tightening the shoulders first. These shoulder blades, you can even see them on the ground, they're kind of pulling back. So three things we want to work on there. So let's tighten. We got our shoulder blades tightening, whole body is tightened. All right, I feel tight. I'm really just tightening. I'm just sitting here tightening. I'm just holding that for a little bit. And that's fine just to hold that for a little bit. And uh, actually gets me off the ground just a little bit with those tightened shoulder blades. All right, now, now we're gonna pull, pull all the way to the chest though. All right, and actually as we let ourselves down, we kind of came back a little further back. Our, our body was a little more this way before. And that's cause, well, <laughs> It, that, that's what allows you to pull the chest, is to get that right angle, that right fulcrum. So now let's do it again, let's tighten. Tighten shoulders, tighten butt, tighten legs, tighten everything. And then we're gonna pull, and there's two. We're taking it real slow, we're not trying to get a bunch of momentum here, we're just doing that each time, so that's two. All right, so tighten. Oh, there we go, three. Whew. Tighten. There we go, four. Taking a long time each time with each of these. Five, Ooh, definitely wearing me out. Tighten, six, definitely had to go in there. So we're definitely, we're running out here at six. I do still want to get to eight, so we'll just push here. We'll get a, we'll get a seven and eight. We'll let them be a little sloppy just to get to eight here. I think that's fine and just to feel good. Okay, so tighten, seven, eight, Ooh, not perfect. Not perfect. I think my form, I'm kind of leaning forward like this a little bit and then pulling. But it's fine. It's fine. We're going to keep homing in on that. We're not going to try to do more than eight until we get this form a little better and we connect the pull-ups a little more smoothly. We're doing great at tightening everything first and getting that, uh, that plank going. So that's what it's all about, guys. Now let's hop out there on the porch. Let's do some squats. Let's do some push-ups. It's interesting, guys. As soon as you do those, those pull-ups and stuff, you really feel your shoulders, they want to come back, you know what I mean? It really gives you that better posture. So it's really great to do those back exercises where you're pulling this back. It's really going to help your posture. Anyway, I just want to point that out. My posture is still pretty in between crappy and, and medium crappy, but it's definitely improved since I've been doing the exercises. So another benefit of getting out there and doing your daily uh, commitments. Um, anyway, let's do these push-ups. I've been thinking almost, of, of you know how I've been breaking up the horizontal pull-ups of breaking these push-ups into, into like two little sets rather than doing all 10 in a row since our push-ups really haven't been going up as fast as our squats. I don't know if I'm gonna mess with that concept today or not, but I'm thinking about it uh, because I wanna keep making progress and I'm not making as much progress with the push-ups as I'd like to be. So just something to think about. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and go right here under the shoulders. We're gonna drop back a little bit, right? You're gonna see us tighten legs and I really wanna focus on tucking that butt under, tighten everything, one, two, 
let's get this right here. I had a little weird angle there. Four, five. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna do six here. We're gonna do six. So that's a set of six. We're gonna come down. Now we're gonna rest a second. We're gonna talk about sets. So sets are a great way to get more exercise done, right? Because otherwise you're just gonna do your number that you can do and then you're burnt out and then you're done for the day. Well, your body recuperates pretty quick and can do another set. Um, but generally I've avoided that because it adds complication to the exercises. I wanted this to be a simple daily commitment, very easy. But as I'm advancing and getting further, I'm kind of running up and I'm slowing down my improvement uh, just because you're not getting as much workout done because uh, you're always having to quit you know, in one go. You're obviously gonna get more done if you do some and then stop and do a little more and then do a little more and, and whatnot. But again, all of a sudden it sounds like you're doing a lot of exercise in the day. But I just, I thought about this. Instead of doing 10 all at once, I'm gonna do two sets of six and that's gonna be 12 push-ups, which is way more than 10, right? But um, you're not hitting your, your run out of gas point as much there because you're not doing them all at once. So anyway, there's six. We're gonna do six again. We're really gonna focus. I've noticed my butt seems to come up a little bit. I'm really focus on, uh, on tucking my butt today and keeping this, this guy nice and tight all around the collar and my shoulders. So here we go, let's do it again. <clears throat> We're already laying down. We're gonna go right here under the shoulders. We're gonna go back a little bit, a couple inches. We're gonna tighten legs. You see legs tighten, butt tighten, chest tighten. One, two. Three, four, five, six. And you can see that six. Two six is a lot is a lot easier than ten all at once, but you're doing more. So hopefully we'll add more strength doing that. Uh, now we're gonna do a magic transition. We're gonna pop in there. We're gonna do those squats. Real quick, guys, I just wanted to point out we still have these awesome shirts for sale. They're my daily commitment shirts. Give you a reminder. A little bit of exercise every day adds up to a lot. Oh great, it's inside out. That's great advertising. I'm doing this great. Anyway, here it is again. You get the little push-up guy right there along with the saying. So, I don't know. I think it's fun. I love having it. It pumps me up. Maybe it'll pump you all up too. Check it out in the link below. Anyway, let's, uh, let's do these squats here. Pop that weight vest on. Alright guys, we've got the weight vest on. We do our squats. One of the things with the squats, same thing. I want to make sure I keep my shoulders back rather than hunching forward as I do the squat, which is kind of what I was doing before. So that's a new thing for squats. We do, are gonna do this with our hand. That's to keep our head spaced so we're looking straight forward and it doesn't kind of vary during the squat. All right, we'll just kind of tuck our other arm over here. Make sure there's legs about shoulder width, maybe a little more, but then the feet are angled out like this. All right, so here we go. Shoulders back, head up, and let's do some squats, guys. One. Well, my elbow kind of hit my uh, leg there. So I gotta try and adjust that. Okay, still kind of elbow in the way, too. Let's, let's just put it maybe back, maybe back here. What's this? It's kind of interesting. Three, kind of keep the arm out of the way. And also uh, keep that shoulder back. Four, don't really like it though. Kind of just get it in the way. Five, maybe up here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and 21, 22, 
and we're pushing 23 or even pushing 24 just to, oh, that's the exercise with the furthest away from max on so we're pushing a little early on that we moved up twice this week by one keep our viewers happy and Ugala thanks for the tip we're gonna push that one exercise and we're doing a little more pushing by splitting those squats into sets we'll see how it goes uh, still working on it man still working on different ideas but the key is you got to get out there every day and just do a little bit play with it try some different things what's gonna happen is you're gonna develop your own ideas you're gonna follow these some are gonna work some are not gonna work but just get out there every do do a little bit of exercise a do it every day B and then just increase it slowly and you're gonna come up with this awesome workout program that you're able to do every day because it becomes a habit so make it a habit make it easy a little bit every day really does add up to a lot subscribe and if you want great awesome content in your in your box every day hit that little bell button next to the subscribe so that you get that notice every day give you guys a boost up anyway We'll see you guys later. Good luck with your daily commitments. See y'all.